What's up guys, this is my review of the Android Revolution ROM for the HTC One X and uh, this is the latest version of the Android Revolution ROM, that is the version 31 and this provides us with the Android 4.2.2, that's the Jelly Bean and we do get the latest version of Sense, that's the Sense 5 so we do have all the new features of the Sense 5 apart from the Zoe so right from the lock screen, as you can see we have the Sense 5 lock screen so guys, uh, to install this ROM, uh, you can follow my previous uh, tutorial on how to install the Android Revolution ROM on your HTC One X. Uh, the link to it is in the description as well. So let's go ahead and have a closer look at this ROM. So as I've already shown you guys, we do get this uh, latest uh, lock screen with the Sense 5. Okay, you can either make a swipe up from here or you can uh, pull this lock up. So that's good. Uh, you do get the Sense 5 icons and this ROM is based on the official Android 4.2.2 firmware for the HTC One X. Uh, you even do get the blink feed and all the Android 4.2.2 features plus the Sense 5 features. Uh, pulling down your notification with two fingers will give you your toggles. Uh, you have quick access to all your toggles. You can uh, swap to your uh, notifications page as well. Let's get into settings and uh, here you have this you know new styled as in you get the sense 5 look and under personalization uh, you also have this uh, sense 5 wallpapers so there you see all right and uh, lock screen style you do get this new lock screens uh, the photo album was available in the previous version as well but this is what uh, you get with the Android 4.2.2 that's the widget lock screen uh, so you can add uh, multiple widgets uh, to your lock screen so that's really good Again, uh, you can customize your home screen. That is, if you like the Blink Feed feature, you can uh, apply it as well. So this is the Blink Feed. So you lock your phone, unlock it, and you get this uh, Blink Feed. And next, you have your normal home screen. But personally, I do not prefer this Blink Feed. So again, disabling it. You also can customize your home screen. That is, add applications, shortcuts, and widgets. Uh, I will come back to it in a moment. You do get this Sense 5 uh, ringtones and notification sounds and so on. You can do the customization from here. Again, uh, apart from that, again, everything is the same. Under display, you do get this new feature. That is the daydream feature. This is somewhat like uh, the screen saving mode. You can uh, enable it, you know, when to daydream, either while docked or while charged or both. Okay. But guys, with this daydream, you do have the option of this colors only okay you do get this colors only uh, but with other Android 4.2.2 like uh, Samsung and stock Android you do get the digital clock and the bean flinger and so on so again apart from that everything is the same you also can do your customizations for your keyboard and stuff let's get into the app drawer so guys this is the app drawer uh, you can uh, change the grid size manage applications and hide applications as well and uh, creating folders on the app drawer is really easy you can just overlap the icons on each other so that uh, you can create a folder and guys uh, this is for the recently opened apps and you have the sense 5 uh, styled recently opened apps you can just make a swipe up to close that application again uh, the camera application also has been uh, updated you do have this new feature as in the, the new UI uh, you can apply various effects before taking a picture all right choose this effect as you can see there you see so various effects uh, again if you want to uh, change the camera you can just make a swipe down from top and you will rotate your camera there you see again make a swipe down you'll get back to the rear camera you can do all your setup from here here you have your settings icon uh, you can uh, do the setup uh, for your scene mode uh, you also get this HDR mode sweep panorama uh, timer and so on so you can go ahead and do your customizations and set up for your camera application again uh, you also can uh, touch to focus pinch in and pinch out to zoom so that's good and while taking a video you also can take a snapshot like this so there you see so definitely the camera app has been updated and that's really good so guys, we don't have any issues regarding this ROM. 
everything is working fine the play store wi-fi bluetooth nfc everything is working absolutely fine no issues at all and even the newer version of sense seems really fast and snappy no issues at all even the launching applications and so on so let's have a look at the benchmark scores for this rom so this is what i got in antutu let's get into gallery now you can organize your gallery in various forms like albums events depending upon the dates you took the picture and guys uh, you will also be getting this uh, this kind of preview on your albums so that's really nice okay there you see and with this ROM we do not get uh, the bloatwares we have all the basic uh, Google applications as well as some uh, important applications okay nothing much so when it comes to adding application shortcuts and widgets you can tap and hold it and uh, you can get access to all your widgets okay and you can place it uh, onto your home screen and adding any application shortcut is like getting into the app drawer tapping and holding that icon go to shortcut and place it on your home screen so very simple so guys this is what you get with this sense 5 everything is really good you even have this sense 5 dialer that's really nice so talking about the battery life the battery life is pretty much the same that you get with the previous version of android but then again this version of android as well as the sense 5 seems really fast and smooth definitely recommend you to get this rom this rom is really fast and really smooth it's stable everything is working fine plus you do get this sense 5 with it so that's all for this video guys if you have any questions please leave it in the comment section and you guys have a great day bye bye now